when you were writing this, did you realise the power and the emotion that you would draw on the big screen from your words? Uh, absolutely not. I, I understood the the power and emotion I felt, but you hope that you hope that translates. You can never say that it will, but you try and put your blood, sweat, and tears onto the page and every emotion that you feel, and 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 trying to live it and feel it every day. And uh, I, you know, I couldn't be prouder of the of the work that Bradley and Clint did. One of the most amazing things is that people were shocked by the ending, in the sense of you took us to a point, and then you didn't show his death. What happened? Why did you not do that? We talked about doing it, but early on I made a promise to Taya, his wife, five days after Chris was murdered. I told her that uh, she called and she said, this is going to be how my children remember their father, so I want you to get it right. And uh, I was very cognizant of the fact, having two kids of my own, that these kids weren't going to remember much of their father at four and six. And I didn't want this movie to be the thing that was hanging over their heads for the rest of their lives as the film that showed their father getting shot in, his, in the back of his head. Yeah, that's fascinating because people would suggested that it was taken out for other reasons. Yeah, no, you know, the the other, we talked about putting it in. I certainly wrote it and we, we, had, we went around and around. We wrote it five different ways and talked about how we would shoot it. Uh, but in the end, I think we felt this was a film about Chris's life and not about his death and uh, about the effect that he had and his sacrifice. And um, we also want to be careful not to glorify the guy who did it. On that note, the film genuinely has been met with mixed reactions across America, mainly in the media rather than the audience. Were you shocked about the reactions that you've had? You know, I'm, I'm happy for any reaction at all. Anytime a movie gets a reaction, it's a good reaction. And the fact that people are talking about soldiers and they're talking about Iraq is a positive reaction, you know. The benefit that we've seen from it, and, and hopefully it continues, is these soldiers see the movie and they and they come home and they start talking and uh, I had the opportunity to sit down with the head of the Veterans Affairs and he said uh, he said this movie has done more in two weeks for veterans than we've been able to do in the last decade and so the idea that this movie has helped them in that way is just such a blessing this is